upon reading this text of Brother Bob's, I was reading the rest of the, the scripture around it and seeing how to understand it more. And I came across the verse that says, in two verses down, that he would grant unto us that we, being delivered out of the hand of our enemies, might serve him without fear. Now this is from Zechariah. He is coming to this song after John has been born and singing about this mercy that is promised to these people. And so when thinking upon this God's mercy, you're always going to be finding yourself coming back to the point of Jesus Christ. And that is because he is the foundation to how any mercy is being distributed into anyone. It is his sacrifice of himself and the position and himself being the horn of salvation. That is the performance of this mercy of God. Him giving Christ. If you want to see someone perform, you expect them to be affected by it. A performance of anything invokes something within them. Now the world provokes emotions by performance, but God's mercy moves people's hearts to do something. Now before this promised mercy was distributed, before Christ came, worshiping God was based mainly on fear, the law. It provoked fear. God would say to do something, and this was a do this and you will be accepted or else you will die situation. God's people, the Israelites, would bring sacrifices to him because that's what God had commanded. Now, there wasn't, we see that there wasn't much heart put into it. It was the fear of the consequence that drew the people. Now, let it be made clear that God hasn't changed, nor will he change. But because he has performed this promised mercy giving Jesus Christ who died and now lives, that more has been opened up, more ways he can give to us to distribute this mercy, and everything has been multiplied and expanded into an abundance. Now this performance of mercy provokes us now to serve God without fear, not this distancy fear, but actually with love. He has freed us from our enemies and has shown us his great love, so we love him. Instead of our service just being a do this so that you'll be accepted or else you will die eternally situation, it, is, it, it still is do this to be accepted. However, if you do this, you will give, have eternal life. You will have riches in heaven. You will be with God. And it continues on. The blessings continue. So see, God hasn't changed. We have changed. He has performed this mercy, provoking no fear that drives away but a love for what is righteous, which is God, so that we will come to Him. He has moved us to come to Him. So continue to come closer to our God. He didn't have to demonstrate this mercy to us, but He wants us to come to Him. And we are living in the peak of this performance, where Christ is glorified and salvation is being opened up and poured to all those who want it. Those who recognize this performance of mercy.